Hey guys, Ace of Vegas here. Hope you're doing well. And there's a whole lot of those things that are up here at the MGM Grand. We better figure out dinner. Is the Ace of Vegas the Ace of Vegas? Okay then, Spinners and Sharks. So we're at the MGM Las Vegas Hotel and Casino, and I am actually starving to death. Well, maybe not to death, but I'm definitely pretty hungry. So I think we're gonna go ahead and check out one of my personal favorite places to eat in the casino. I think we're gonna go ahead and see what the bar is like at Wolfgang Puck Bar and Grill. So let's go ahead and go check that out. See if we can get in. Okay, Spinners and Sharks, we got ourselves a contactless menu over here. So I'm kind of hanging out at the bar right now. It's pretty quiet. It's only about six o'clock. And I've got some, uh, got an IPA. They're doing a flight of IPAs. I think it was like four for 25 bucks or something like that. So I figured I'd go ahead and try it out. And they do full pints and all that too. So not a bad deal. And I am ready for this. I'm not sure what I'm gonna have. Probably gonna go ahead and just stick with something kind of light today. I'm definitely in the mood for a quality burger too. So we'll go ahead and find out what we got going on over there. They also had like a pan seared scallop. Uh, actually, you know what? I might do the scallop. I might do the scallop. I'm in a, in a pretty good mood. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, look at this beautiful beer, though. That is one beautiful beer. Let's go ahead and have a drink of that. Mmm, delicious. Absolutely delicious. All right, Spinach and Sharks, we just got our beautiful dinner here. It's a special, so it's pan-seared uh, scallops, and it's over um, some mashed puree. So it's mashed potatoes, but it's fancy mashed potatoes, and then a bed of spinach, too. So really looking forward to this. This was a special today at Wolfgang Puck. This was over the uh, 4th of July weekend. I think it was running about $44, which... Um, it's a little on the pricier side, I'm sure, for just an entree, but it comes with the sides embedded, so that's pretty nice. And also, I don't think that I can get uh, scallops as cheap back in Denver, too, so this is some pretty good stuff. I'm really looking forward to this. So let's go ahead and have a bite see how it is. All right. We're going in. A couple chives in here, too. Here's some mash. We're going to try the mash. Oh. Okay, that's pretty good mash right there. And the scallops, oh wow. Very tender scallops. Let's have that with a mash too. Mmm. Mmm. Okay, that's really good. So I don't normally do seafood in landlocked areas. Uh, Vegas is the exception though, because I always bring the good stuff in there. Being from Brooklyn, I love, you know, love me some seafood, but I like it fresh. I'm not sure about Vegas, what it is about Vegas, but they bring it fresh, they bring it frequently. And it tastes really, really good. So I think it's going to be a lovely dinner. Get me started for the night. It's actually got me kind of excited to go hit up El Cortez, see if they can, uh, see if I can win some money off their free play. Hmm. Yeah, it was actually really good. Wow. All right. So this was off the menu, but we'll talk a little more about the contactless menu right now. All right, Spinners and Sharks, I actually took pictures of the entire menu. So if you want to take a glance and see what's available before you go down to MGM Grand and hit up Wolfgang Puck, stick around and go ahead and check this out here while I give you my final thoughts on my experience. So guys, I'd say overall the experience was pretty positive. There wasn't much of a wait, and while having a reservation was helpful, it wasn't required when you were doing a solo trip. Uh, the unfortunate downside to a solo trip there was the fact that you won't get a chance to redeem my Vegas reward. But overall I did feel safe, the food was good, and I felt pretty comfortable. Overall, the experience was definitely a solid 4 out of 5.
Okay, Sprinters and Sharks, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed today's review and found it informative, I'd appreciate a like. And consider subscribing if you haven't already. Also consider following us on our other social media platforms and check out the new merch store in the description box below if you're looking for a cool mask to rock on your Vegas trip. Next time, I think we're going to get back to my Vegas slots and help you earn some more rewards with a new feature. But until next time, this is Ace of Vegas signing out and I'm wishing you all strong hands and, of course, happy spinning, you guys. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva Ace of Vegas.